my Pac-Man frogs out. Well, I kind of woke him up, but I, uh, he ate a super worm. He's not that big, and he, I mean, he's grown since I got him, I think, but I can't really tell. He's kind of, I don't know, he's kind of fat. He, I just missed his tank. Look at a little dry. He, uh, just, yeah, um, Yeah, so he does this basically every night. I missed it, and I put a sh shirt on top. And it keeps the moisture in. I also just uh, woke them up just to check on them. So I always like to check on them at night. Make sure they're all fine. I've raised her since she was a baby, so... And, um... I just, uh... Yeah, but they do this. So usually she will sleep on the log and he'll sleep in that little corner back there. But uh, I, I woke them up. But tonight I found him on the rock in the back. At, at nighttime, my gnolls sleep. I have three. One of the female green gnolls was old. So, he, I don't know what he has, but he started acting really weird a little while ago. Like, he started, whenever he tries to run away, he just runs in a circle and his head's kind of wobbly. So, I don't really know what's wrong with him. But he's still eating and he's still fat. So, I'm not completely worried. And the isopods in here had babies, which I'm very happy about. Also, there's the and all right here right there Oop. she she ran into the, the plant and there's another green and all in that tree yeah right there whenever I come into my room I let I just put a super room in there to see if they wanted it whenever I come in my room my leopard geckos always go back in and they hide I can't really get an angle on them, I, but I can see one back in the back. I don't want to shine a flashlight, I don't want to disturb them, so. Well, no, I'll just turn it on for a second. There's the female right. Glass is all gross. But, in, but there's the male. You can see him. Sorry, glare.